I'm going to introduce the client. His name is Yong Shang Han. He's 30 years old. He's married. He has a nine-year-old son. He's highly intellectual. He has his PhD. Um, he works long hours from 7 in the morning till 8 at night. Um, he's employed by Samsung. He has aspirations to study further towards his doctrine. Um, hopefully he wants to immigrate to USA one day soon. In his spare time, he likes to travel, he likes technology, swimming, golfing, and photography. Um, his son plays the piano, or is learning to play the piano. And he's a very really busy guy, but he has big goals because he wants to retire by the time he's 45. All right, so we <clears throat> looked at the moments of truth that uh, this customer goes through uh, every time they have to buy their weekly groceries and we found out that he basically goes through 15 steps in order to do this which is quite tedious and doesn't help him because he wants to reduce the amount of time he spends uh, purchasing uh, his monthly grocery shopping. Um, we then looked at alternative ways of achieving the activity or removing the activity or moment of truth altogether. Uh, we then looked at whether the um, solutions uh, provided would be increasing the service that he receives, decreasing uh, the amount of money that he spends uh, or costs, and increasing revenue for Tesco. Uh, from there we, we chose um, the most important or the, the solutions that made the most sense uh, to us. Uh, and then compiled our 2B uh, scenario. Okay. All right, so what we've decided to do is to go the IKEA route. So we um, are actually pulling our stores out of the um, high-priced um, retail environments where the rentals are high. We've been bringing them into more of the warehouse spaces within the city. Um, what we then do is we have a central system that has apps that uh, you basically sign up for. You register on the app, you provide some profile detail of number of people in your household that you need to prepare food for, um, their ages, their dietary preferences, those kind of things. Um, what the app then does is it prepares a first version of that shopping list, but it's a shopping list with a difference because it's pre-prepared -pre food based on the profiles of the people that you loaded, their dietary preferences, those kind of things. It shows that to you together with any other groceries that you need. Um, and then you basically say, yes, I want that, or no, I don't want that, and you can chop and change it. And you can do that every time you see the list. Um, then you basically, it's like a link, sorry, like, to, uh, like uh, um, Amazon's one click. So once you click on yes, it automatically processes the payment. The automated warehouse where all of this is uh, prepared with uh, automation um, basically picks the specific meals and the other groceries that's required with uh, robotics. Um, the drones that are residing on the, the roof of this uh, warehouse pick up those specific parcels. They courier them off to your address. Um, at the predetermined uh, the delivery time that you want, you also give them secure access to your home. Um, so they will go in, they transform inside the home, and they become a uh, packer. So they pack the groceries into the uh, cupboards for you. Um, then when you get home, uh, or before you get home, when, um, when you decide we're going to have dinner tonight at 6 o'clock on your app, you just say, Now's a good time to, to have the meals prepare themselves. So it's pre um, it, it's pre prepared and now it's self heating. So basically, it activates the heating mechanism if it's a, a hot dinner. Um, when you get home, it's ready for you to just put on the table to enjoy with your family. Uh, once you're done, you basically just throw everything in the dustbin, and the dustbin now becomes an incinerator because it's biodegradable, and uh, that's your meal, and you can enjoy the rest of the evening with your family. Looking at the impact that the new process has in terms of your service cost and revenue, from a service perspective, we said that it's going to um, give you more time, so allow flexibility where you can log on via your office and place your order via your app at any place or location. 
Um, in terms of our cost, we see that um, we're going to have less staff because everything is digital. So everything will be done via the app. Also, our rental cost will be lower because we're going to have bigger warehouses and we're not going to have these little stores all over the place. And also in terms 